Let's start off by saying porn isn't really the issue. Um, <laughs> the, the issue is the idea of free internet access for everything. I mean, it's not fair to give certain sites better speeds and some sets lower speeds. I mean, I know there's spam sites on the internet, but that's one of the beautiful things about the internet is this idea that it's free, it's open, you can do whatever you want with it. I mean, yeah, there are some shady parts on the internet that you don't want to go to, but the idea that you can put the information out there, that anybody can access the information is what makes the internet a beautiful place. Um, I kind of like to go into the idea that was argued earlier that um, you, ISPs won't be able to control what's going on in their network if net neutrality were to be put in place, but that's actually simply not true. Um, when it comes to purposes that the ISP should actually control the internet for, which generally I think would apply to the law, ISPs are allowed to do what, um, according to the proposition, are allowed to do whatever they want when it comes to handling with the law. The only um, thing is that they have to be transparent about it. They have to tell the end user that, hey, you know, we're this uh, government organization subpoenaing your records and we're going to give them to them. But they're allowed to stop traffic if they want to if it comes to compliance with the law. And another issue um, that is, well, it's not really another issue, it's the same issue. The idea that ISPs can't control traffic, well, typically what's going on that's illegal on the internet is copyright. People downloading music, movies, you know, copyrighted content. Um, but I'd like to argue that ISPs shouldn't be in charge of being copyright police. If anything, it's, their, it's the, uh, the copyright owner's um, job to protect their copyright, therefore they should be the ones controlling it. Um, there are plenty of tools in place for copyright owners already to take control of their own media. You can file a claim, did I lose the card? Okay, I know what I know. Under the Digital Millennium Copyright Act, you can, copy, you can file what's called a takedown notice, and within, I believe, 20 days, whoever you file it to has to take it down if it does, in fact, violate copyright. The only problem with this is that occasionally they are overused. Um, I'm sure you have all seen on YouTube when it's like, oh, this was taken down by WMG Records or something like that. Um, they are occasionally overused and kind of trespass into fair, uh, fair use, but that's not the point of this debate. Um, the point is that the ability to regulate what the internet is being used for is out there. Um, and I guess I'd like to close with the idea that we're not trying to hurt the ISPs or anything. We're just trying to say that the internet's a free place. We should keep it that way and we should put in regulations that allow it to be put in place. The FCC has the ability to regulate every other form of communication. Telephone, radio, television. They do have regulations for all of these, so why shouldn't the internet be the same? Um, that's it.